Hey, what's up, guys? This is Vitaly. Welcome to Touch Talk Studio. And today we're actually not going to talk about photography or video equipment, but we're actually going to talk about what to use to carry your equipment. Coming up next. So I have been, um, as many of you guys, probably over time you start accumulating some of your photography and video equipment and your amount that gear that you carry with you sometimes varies. Sometimes it's a little, too little, sometimes it's too much and um, it gets heavy over time and we get older, more mature, we maybe not as strong. So I started to rethink a little bit about what camera gear do I carry with me as well as what do I put my camera gear into. So um, over the past couple years I have been using really this cool backpack that I've been using and this is made by Low Pro and this is a Pro Tactic BP450 AW2 and I really love this backpack. It's solid, it's got a hard shell up here on top it got plenty of uh, spaces inside. It got side pockets. It got basically like a raincoat in the, in the, for, the, for the weather. Uh, great straps, um, really very practical. So I really appreciate it. But also I'm recognizing that if I am traveling, if I need a little bit more space, I, I needed something bigger. And um, so after doing some of my research, I came across this new, and I say new for me, um, company, um, Nanook. And uh, so I ordered my case from them. I've been very interested. Um, they're very similar. They make similar cases to Pelican, um, just a little bit different design and different construction. So I decided to try them out. Um, I ordered this case probably about a month ago and it was out of stock for uh, various reasons. But anyhow, I received it just now and these are my first impressions of what this case looks like. Am I going to be happy about it? And I will unbox it right in front of you and we will talk about it. So just so you know, uh, this company, Nanook, really makes, makes a um, cases of different sizes. They have medium-sized cases, small cases, uh, large cases, long cases, um, wheel cases. I'm kind of surprised that they don't make a shipping containers. Um, but anyhow, so what I decided to order is this case in particular. And this case is wheeled. And just so you know, the reason I ordered this case is because of this airplane, okay? And the purpose of this airplane right over here, it means it's a carry on for airlines, for airplanes. So. I am planning to travel with this case and um, specific dimensions I think uh, that airline companies have is you're gonna have to make sure that it is 14 inches long, basically tall, and it's 14 inches wide and nine inches deep. And this is the exact dimensions of this case, including the wheels. So let's unbox it and check this out. There we go. Okay, so yes, it is orange. Okay, um, it's uh, case number 935. Uh, the nice thing, actually, actually it is made in Canada. Uh, why did I order the orange one? I don't know, I just like it. Um, there is a this company makes a variety of different colors from black to red, blue, graphite, um, orange, as you can see. It almost makes you look like you are transporting some kind of a, um, organs or something. But, so let's see. Um, this case is very, very well built, I would say. Um, I really love the, the hard shell. And um, obviously you got the wheels and it's super smooth. Um, in the front, it has this handle, 
And, but the nice thing about this handle, it's actually a lockable handle. As you can see, it clicks in place so it doesn't bounce around when you, when you walk with it. Um, it got these latches up here and the way to open these latches, you can't really pull on them like this, right? So this is what I like about this case when I was initially looking at it, but you have to pull this uh, gray lever down and then it will open up. So I haven't seen, haven't opened the case yet. You guys are the first one to see this. Here we go. All right, so let's see what do we have in here. Um, now, one of the reasons I believe this case was out of stock initially was because of this lid organizer. And I'm gonna talk a little bit more about this lid organizer as we're discussing and looking at this case. So it comes with little uh, brochure on our company. And obviously you can see red, blue, yellow, black cases. Uh, they have a variety of colors. And uh, comes with this insert, okay. And um, honestly, my first impression, I thought that this case is a little bit bigger. So I'm hoping it will fit most of my equipment that I need when I travel. I am trying to minimize how much I bring with me uh, because then it kind of impacts your creativity when you travel, when you have everything that you own. And um, so it basically talks about different compartments here. And yeah, this is what it looks like. So we got this two red um, straps, uh, probably to hold some of your equipment, maybe if it's a little bit loose. You got this little opening here for uh, most likely the wheels uh, within this uh, case. And um, yeah, I'm gonna have to really organize it and I'm probably gonna do a follow-up video actually, what I put in this case and what it looks like. So. Yeah, I would say overall, my first impressions of this case are, yeah, I think it's pretty spectacular. So let's talk a little bit about this um, lid organizer. So as most of you uh, have, I have a bunch of different um, cables and little accessories that I need to bring with me that maybe it's a microphones or maybe it's a flash or, or something smaller and I need to find a ways to put it in in my camera bag, which I usually use in different pockets. Now, this one has uh, nice little zippers, and what I like about this one, it's clear. So you can actually get to see what's inside of your case and where it's located so you don't have to search for it. Now, in addition to that, they do have and provide a little opening slot for a laptop, and I believe you can uh, fit probably at least uh, 15 inches, maybe even bigger, 16 inch laptop which if you have one and you're looking to carry uh, when you travel, you got a place for that as well. Uh, so overall, first impressions, I feel like it's very well built. Um, I like the way, I love the color. Um, I was a little bit hesitant when I ordered the orange color because I was thinking, well, is it gonna stand out too much? Is it gonna draw too much attention? But I think I still like it. I still like it. Um, again, it's a Nanook 935 uh, model uh, made in Canada. Um, very well built, it feels like it. Um, I have never owned the Pelican cases um, for the most part, except for like a little um, cards organizer. And that one is okay, uh, but this one is definitely feels like a nicely built. And um, I will be making a follow-up video on this one. I love the fact that um, it has this, obviously handle, basically it's almost like a retractable handle that goes inside right over here. And um, obviously has the long handle when you're walking. So I will be trying this out uh, just to see, make sure it fits my size, my height. Um, I think for the most part, it is going to be okay. I can definitely feel it. Um, my, hand, my, my hand perfectly reaches down there and down um, to hold it. And I'm about 5'10". Uh, so again, no issues at all. Oh. Guys, let me know in the comments below um, what do you think about the color? Uh, do any of you own one of these cases? And what's your uh, long-term experience with uh, owning a case such as this one? 
and I will see you in the next video.